So today we were here in Fujianics Mahadi to enjoy El Clásico. I'm very happy how the, how the match was uh, evolving in terms of entertainment, but especially on how the event was uh, dealt by the organization, both uh, Mavericks, the agency we were working with, and the place, Fujianics, and especially all the friends that were gathering here today to enjoy one of the best uh, matches in the world, one, at least one of the most famous matches in the world. And uh, well, we, we gathered more than uh, 700 people inside, uh, which for, the, for today, which is a Sunday, is a Labor Day here in Egypt, it was a challenge, but we managed to do it and I think the outcome was fantastic, everything uh, went well, so we're very happy and of course we want to give a special thanks to our um, sponsor for this event, to all the developers, which uh, without them that, that uh, wouldn't be possible, so, so uh, many thanks to them and uh, hope to, to collaborate uh, again soon. El Clásico is one of the most, most important matches, basically because the people want to watch it. And it's funny because uh, it doesn't matter if the Madrid or Barcelona are not in the best moment of, uh, of their uh, maybe trajectory during the more than one century of history, but the Clásicos is still something that if you like football, you, you want to, to watch this kind of matches. So at the end, that's why only Egypt probably has more than 30 million audience and worldwide more than 1 billion audience. This is something that uh, very few uh, sports competition in the world can, can say, maybe the final of the Super Bowl and few less. So we're very happy to have this uh, product to show to our fans and uh, we hope to, to gather even a huge and uh, major event for the second leg. So the last question, uh, a Clásico in Cairo. So the possibilities to play a Clásico out of Spain nowadays are, are few, but it is true that the entertainment is uh, developing in a way that uh, I think anything is possible during the next year. So why not to see, not maybe the physical version of El Clásico here in Cairo, but to gather a virtual reality watch party in which the fans can have the same experience as the, if they were in Camp Nou or in Bernabeu. I think the future is very exciting in, in this regard. So why not to see something like this uh, happening in Cairo, especially with the huge fan base that you have here from Madrid, Barcelona, and especially the, the Spanish clubs. So I think that will be one of the best places to have something like this, definitely. La Liga this year in Egypt is uh, having a great amount of news. Uh, the first and most important is that we are entering into a joint venture with a company called Galaxy Racers. It was announced a couple of uh, weeks ago um, that is going to put uh, La Liga in the whole Middle East region in another dimension. This uh, Galaxy Racers, this partner, it's a partner specialized in social media, in entertainment, in esports. So I think it's going to be a very good match with all our activities here. And just imagine the possibilities of having them as a partner uh, through a joint venture in an event like this. Uh, we can be talking about esports competition, we can be having uh, live shows there. So I think this is going to be huge, not only in Egypt, but in the whole region. And of course, here in Egypt, we are still developing a lot of projects in our main verticals. Um, education, formation to the clubs, consultancy. So I think it's going to be a very interesting year for, for all the Egyptian football fans and especially the ones which are following La Liga activities because of course we always want more and we always want bigger. So I think this is uh, our goal this, uh, for this year here in Egypt.